you were one of the bright spots in this game. I know you guys lose the team, but um, just talk about coming out and having some success or the first contest. How did, how did you help you know, the rest of the team succeed? Um, I feel like coming into the game, we was energized. We kind of started off slow. And as an offense, we kind of started picking up our road throughout throughout the game. I feel like if we worked harder, faster, and got and got going earlier in the game, it would have been a different ball game. Hey, K. Sean, it seemed like there were so many passes that were on receivers' hands, and then a hammer come knock it out, or just not secure. I mean, how, how would you um, look back at the wide receivers and how you guys played tonight on some balls that were kind of fifty-fifty? I mean, we, I feel like the 50-50 balls, we got to come down with them. We really didn't make contested catches as we know we should, and we really didn't play to the LSU standard of performance. So you got to go back into next week, catching jugs, doing it after practice, practicing. You got to learn from it. Yeah, Keishon, obviously as Max got under pressure, you guys kind of had to adjust to me. What were those conversations like in the first, second quarter, kind of trying to, to adjust away from all that pressure? See, the conversations was just got to speed the routes up a little bit. They're sending pressures, and there's a lot of man on the outside, so just win your one-on-ones. Hey, Kishan, obviously this was a pretty wild week for y'all, being on the road the whole time. Did you feel like that affected you guys in any way? Nah, I mean, I don't feel like it did, but it was just something new we had to adjust to. That's all it was. Yeah, kind of to what Wilson was saying, where, where the you've been yourself, Louisiana a guy, where, where people were you know worried about people at home, that sort of thing. Was can you look at the past week and say was any kind of detraction, or you say you, you got beat tonight? That's it. Uh, I'm gonna just be real. We got beat tonight. Beat up front. Beat all around. It just it just outplayed us for 60 minutes. Yeah, K. Sean. Uh, it seemed like in the first quarter. The tempo was really slow, like the plays were slow coming in. I mean, uh, the adjustments were slow. It seemed that way to you, and it, and it picked up in the second quarter. It seemed like you got in a better rhythm. Um, so we didn't play a game in like eight months, so it was kind of coming slow, getting back in the rhythm of it. And once we found our rhythm and found out how we moved the ball, we just started moving it up in the tempo, going faster. Hey, Sean, could you just describe, I guess, just, you know, what, what it's been like since, uh, you know, since you had to evacuate Baton Rouge and what, you know, what the, I guess what the week is, week or so, week, week plus has been, you know, like being on the road and. Uh, personally, I feel like it's been a long week, it's been a long seven days since we ain't been to the, uh, in the city, so it's just different and. Like, like I had said earlier, it was just something we had to adjust to, but Coach O felt like it was the best decision for the team, so that's what we did. Was it unsettling in any way? I mean, just for, I, I guess, maybe some of the guys more than others, depending on what, you know, what their home situations, you know, were like with, uh, you know, with the, with the storm? No, sir. Hey, Sean, Matt Trent, WBRZ. Coach O talked about how physical they were tonight. I mean, I don't know how else to articulate this, but do you just feel like UCLA was tougher than you guys tonight? I mean, I mean, I, personally, I feel like they wasn't tougher than us. It was just we made mental errors all around in different aspects throughout the game, and that's what cost us. Okay, nobody took them lightly. You don't, you don't think that you guys weren't focused on your preparation yet? Nah, I mean, I feel like we was focused. It's just everything happened for a reason. So you just got to learn from it. Okay, Sean, did you notice how many LSU fans were here tonight and made the long trip over here? Oh, yeah, yes, sir. It was nice seeing it, knowing that they followed us all the way to California just to watch us play. That's love, for real, for real.